Welcome to this video. In this series of videos, we are explaining an inverse finite element modeling to find appropriate pressure in tube hydroforming to create a tube with desired diameter. In the first video, we model tube hydroforming in abacus environment, and in this video, we explain how we could extract the final diameter of the tube from the ODB file by Python scripting. In fact, we should extract displacement of the central node of the tube in one direction. We pull out displacement and also we use query and prop value to find displacement of this point. And final diameter of the tube can be found by this displacement. Here is a displacement related to this node. We want to find Python command related to extracting this displacement. At first we should open the ODB by this line. We can open the ODB which is existed in the work directory by the name that ODB. This command put entire ODB in a parameter ff and now we can use this parameter to extract any data from the ODB by typing the name and then typing a dot and pressing the tab key we can find possible commands on this parameter we put the output in the U parameter and press the tab key. We have several functions and operation on the ODB. As you can see in this figure, for reaching to a field output in an ODB, at first we should go through the steps and then frames and then field outputs. I write S and press the tab key and then write a bracket and by pressing the tab key we can find that we have only one step named step 1 then another dot and I type F and by pressing tab key I can find a command to reach to the frames and then write a bracket we should go to the last frame by pressing tab key we can find frame number but as we want the last frame we type minus 1 for the last frame which means ends of the simulation another time a dot and this time we want a field output by writing F and pressing tab key and then a bracket and another time tab key as field outputs or dictionaries we should enter a key and find our desired parameters the key for displacement is U we press the tab key until we find the U as the key for displacement of field output. For extracting other outputs like stress, strain, reaction force and other outputs, you should only change the key of the field outputs. Now we have displacements of all nodes of the model. To find displacement in our specific node, we use another comments values and enter the node number. As you can see here, there is more than 100 nodes in this model and we should find the specific number of our node. By option command, we can plot node labels of the tube. Our interested node number is 91, but usually we should type another number very close to this number here maybe minus one or plus one and by that data we can find displacement vector of this node which contains two components in x and y direction and the first direction is not equal to the value of displacement in our desired point so we change the number of the node by plus one or minus one if i type 90 here we have another u which is not even equal with our desired value but if i type 
92, I can see that the first component of the U is exactly equal to the desired value which is the final diameter of the tube. These two lines, the first one for opening the ODB and putting it in the parameter and the second one for finding the displacement in our desired node can be used in our code to extract displacement of this node which can be used to calculate final diameter of the tube. In our next videos, we will explain how we could use these two lines in our codes and extract final diameter of several simulations. Thank you guys for watching this video. If this video has helped you out, please let us know by a like, a comment or a subscribe. See you in next videos.